Hold on, don't make me get lit. Talk out your mug, get punching your shit. Bitch, throw a neck cause they fuck with the fit. I'm going up and it's making them sick. Jojo, what's the message for this year? I want to What's up, you two? What's up? For me, I ain't like, I haven't been knowing what to post and shit like that, but I know I want to start YouTube though, for me, so. Y'all gonna see me more, I ain't gonna lie. We just gonna go up, swear. Swear! On bro, no, let me stop. But yo, look, turn to the merch, man, kind of garments. Feel me? Shout out to my son, Deli Vado. Oh, no, I'm bugging, Deli Otre, that's his new name. I mean, tune into my son, merch, I ain't gonna lie. But listen, man, right now we're gonna do a story time. For me, because I just want to post saying a lot. This shit gonna be interesting though. It's a story time about how I got, you know? I got, I got, let me stop. I ain't get shot. I got shot at. I never been shot a day in my life. God, thank you for never for me. Letting that happen to me. You know, shout out to the ones who survived gunshots, but I, I don't ever want to feel that feeling. I ain't gonna lie, Ben, want to tell the story. I'm gonna change up for me some of it because I ain't trying to disclose information. Just in case, you know. The oink oinks is watching. Uh, situation been handled, my brother. A word for me. We just gonna, no, we just gonna vibe out. This is like, oh yeah, I did this video before for me, but now I got an official camera, so I'm, a, I'm for me, I'm gonna show y'all a little piece of it, you know, from what I did on my phone. It was horrible quality. This is gonna be way better. Boom, niggas gonna pull up to the block. Let me suck with you, Jack. I'm gonna nigga suck my dick. For me, my son put the RPG with the switch and started switching that mofo. Let me stop, yeah. <laughs> nah, but real shit though, like, nigga, feel me? Me and my son got clapped at. I ain't gonna lie, real shit. Right, let me put y'all on, feel me? So listen, you know in high school, when. I'm bugging, I'm bugging. Let me give you the backstory. So you know in high school, when you have your little group of friends and shit, y'all have your own group. Our group name was Gorilla Gang. So every time I say GG, I'm not talking about for me. If you're from the Bronx, you know, if you know, you know. I'm not talking about that. Shout out to Dumb Dog for me, but I'm talking about my group of friends in high school. We, till this day, we call each other GG. Since we're Gorilla Gang, or we'd be like Double G. So, shit like that. I'm just getting the backstory. Come in. Coming in. Alright, so boom, for that. Alright, let me. Alright, so I already told you the GG shit. So, let's just say, um, for me, we in high school, we just chilling and shit. And I'm not there. So let me give my, for me, my little backstory to it. So my friend, Michael, had a problem with a guy named Robert. All right? So my friend, Michael, had a problem with a guy named Robert. He told me that he punched him in gym. Shit like that. So he punched him in gym. I, I was not there for me. I'm just hearing about all this shit happening. So it's like, oh, Robert fake weird. But my loyalties lies with my son, Michael. Cause that's for me. He's GG. That's yeah, nigga. If you GG, I got you for life, for life till this day, till this day. <laughs> for me, so my friend Michael telling me what happened, shit like that. And as days go on, for me, it just continuing, continuing, it just going up. You know how, you know how niggas is. I ain't gonna lie, beef be like petty and shit like that. So he's telling me all this and shit happening and whatnot, and I'm like, damn. But then eventually, it gets to a point where Michael tells me, yo, bro. Stop chilling with Robert. Like, we not jacking that nigga no more. I'm like, damn. Feel me? So, if Michael telling me stop chilling with Robert, I know where my loyalties lie. Nigga, it's fuck Robert, nigga. I'm smoking his <laughs> Let me stop. Nah, but... We not, we not smoking nobody. I'm a consecrator. I do not word. Feel me, but word. Like... So, boom. He told me that. And I'm just like, damn. Like, what well, happened? He telling me that nigga sucker punched him and shit like that, and he just been on some weird animosity shit. I'm like, all right, for me, I said it, it's whatever. So then school comes, right? Well, not even like just this random day in school. Like my son Michael, he's telling me that he want to get the the one ons with Robert. I'm just like, damn. I never thought he'd get to this, but he's telling me he gonna get the one ons and that. But he's like, I'm there at the right time. He don't get caught from school. He don't have no more infractions because our school's fake. Our school was fake on deck. I ain't gonna lie. Like, you probably fight like two, three times. They pack you up, nigga. 
Our school was uniform. It shit was like a military school. I kid you not. It was like a military school, but not a military school. Like it was, it was pretty strict for me. But everybody just broke the rules so much that they kept on easing down. But our school was horrible for me. So, all right. So let me continue. I forgot what was that. How the fuck are you looking at me, dickhead? All right, so let me continue. So we just waiting for the perfect opportunity for me to. We're not planning to hop or nothing like that. That means jump, if y'all don't understand. Hop means jump. But we're not planning to hop that nigga or whatever. We just wanted, well, my son Michael just wanted the fair one ons with Robert. So I'm like, all right, we're going to do that. We're going to situate that. But I guess perfect time how it came. So I kid you not, it was like a couple, like three, three weeks later. We just chilling outside. You know, in New York, when you chilling outside after school, it just, I kid you not, it's like just kids trying to find bad shit to do. Or just have sex, sweet. Like nobody, you feel me? Nobody doing nothing productive. I swear to God, we just digging around. So we chilling outside by our school, cause he he lived fake by our school. Boom. He comes up. He's there with somebody I forgot. And then one of my mans was there for me. He went to me. He was like, "Yo, bro, my son might even get the one on." I ain't gonna lie, Robert was fake paying again. I'm gonna keep it a buck. I'm you know what's funny? I'm cool with both sides now, but I ain't gonna lie, Robert was fake. Like what the fuck on some weird shit, like. Why you, why you on that? Like, but my son Mike wanna get the one on, feel me? And then Michael came up to me, said, I dad wanna get the one on. Like, what happened? For me? They fool or not. So listen, this the this the part gave me tight. Cause everybody was seeing, like, somebody was a corner all that for me. And my eyes, and my eyes, it was like a tie, tie fight, I swear. It was a tie. But then the person recording, I guess he cut at certain angles, that made seem like Robert win. So they they they, they clowned at us cause they was like, they like, how the fuck we let our mans get beat up out of this, that, in front of us, and we ain't do nothing? But I kid you, if you was there, you would see that the fight was like a tie, bro. It was like a tie. Keep it up a thousand. But, I didn't even got me tight. I forgot. Robert looked at all, all of us weird. He thought we was, like, trying to blitz him or some shit like that. He was like, no, bro. It was just for me beef the niggas had to handle. From there on, it just kept on getting worse. All right, so, yeah, days passed by for me. Now shit's getting real, like, I ain't gonna lie, like, it's just getting crazy. So now, like, it's just mad animosity, like, mad petty shit. That's the thing, bro. I feel like now these days, people just have animosity to each other. Like, shit just be weird, bro. No funny shit, like, it's, I goes on to this day. We cool with the robber nigga now, but, like, it's just weird shit. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, we need to change that as uh, society and whatnot. But for me, the beef continues, right? It just... Now it's just straight animosity and shit like that. So Robert ended up coming to the park, I think, with three people. I don't remember. I remember it was just two dickheads who were just recording and laughing and shit. And then it was, for me, one nigga that was really cool with, for me. My son played both sides, I ain't gonna lie. So then, I think Robert asked us to play ball or some shit like that. He asked us to play ball. Like, my son Michael was like, who the fuck are, like, playing ball with you after, for me? You just doing weird shit and shit like that. So I'm just like, oh, shit. <laughs> Shit, I got serious and whatnot, feel me? So yeah, nigga, what happened? So yeah, after Rob asked to play ball, and Michael found that first thing he even asked, like it was just weird after that. And then I think Rob was just acting like tough because he came with those three people. So then they end up fighting. And I'm gonna keep it a buck. At that time, Michael dead lost that fight. I ain't gonna lie. Michael's still my man, so he knows stuff. So. But I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it a buck. Michael lost that fight. But he chose the wrong day to like even go harder in the fight because we was deep, right? So they fought like two times and they were three. So after like the second, third time, we was probably gonna hop in. <laughs> he was like, gonna hop that nigga. <laughs> nigga almost went now. I ain't gonna lie. Just hopping that nigga. And then the friend that we was all cool with really started going mad hard at us, moving like niggas gotta shake and shit like that. So now I'm just looking at him like, what the fuck, bro? Why you talking like that? Like, and Rob, mind you, Rob is there acting mad weird. Just keep saying funny shit and whatnot. Like, I know he feel like the man. We was getting tight. Our friend that was there, I'm going to say his name is um Trojan. Trojan, yeah. His name is Trojan. Don't judge me. But where my son Trojan was acting mad weird and shit. You're like, fuck out of here. So then... It just, for me, it was just being mad, like, little animosity. Like, it was mad built up and shit. We came. We was deep. For me, 
it was me, Michael, it was GG, you know, GG and us. And then it was just Robert and his friends and whatnot. Like, it was like three of them. But then the Trojan nigga saved Robert because I ain't gonna lie. When Michael lost, like, Robert's talking crazy, so we about to hop him. Right there. But mind you, we did not care about that before, for me. But he was just talking very crazy, like, you know what I'm trying to say? I'm supposed to be mean, like, just shake it off and then. But then, yeah. So then eventually, ended up that day, what happened? That day, ooh, that day we went, right? So we started spinning. Like, it turns for a fight to us spinning his hood. He mind you, live right by the school. So we went to his building. We were like, what's up? Like, tell nigga come downstairs. Because one of my mans was talking to his, like, some girl he was trying to get on. For me, a word. For me, we tell him, like, we telling her, like, yo, bro, tell that nigga come downstairs. Like, what's up? I had to stand there for a fifth. Nigga, Robert just ducking right. All that for me. Keep it a buck thousand. Yeah, I'm talking like that nigga's not cool. He's <laughs> that cool now for me, but I'm just saying, like, fuck you. At that time, it was fuck you for me, but yeah, at that time, she was just going down and shit. You tell him come downstairs. Nigga, wanna come downstairs? Like, it's whatever for me. Home visits and shit. We just right in front of his building, just waiting for him to come downstairs. But eventually, his brother comes out. <laughs> his brother came out and he was acting crazy. Like, this nigga thought he was insane, some shit, feel me? But his brother come out and he have a, a hoodie on and he's like pretending like to clutch something. I ain't gonna lie, at that time, at that time when people like pretend to clutch something, I, lie, I used to fake like just get a little scared and shit like that. Now if someone clutch for me, I'm gonna be mad chill, but I'm, I might even get angry at the fact that he's trying to clutch something. But back then, nigga, I was terrified. Nigga, I'm thinking I'm about to go out. Shit, me. Think about it, that's the for me. That's the first time guns was kind of involved. I, I think he was pump faking. That means I think it was lying. But his brother came out since the clutch saying. He like, where y'all niggas from? Y'all niggas not crazy? Ah, y'all not on that? Just trying to yell at all of us for me. And we just like, yo, bro, where your brother at, bro? Why are you talking for him? Shit like that. Niggas started just wilding out and shit. I'm just like, the fuck? Why, like, why are you moving like that? But then, his brother just kept on talking crazy. And it was at a certain time. I ain't gonna lie, I was dead thinking. I'm like, yo, bro, if I punch him mad hard so fast, like, we could just hop this nigga right here. Because his brother, that's not my issue for me. But you talking crazy to me now, nigga. Shop. Damn. Damn. Hold on. Buff my boots, nigga. Oh yeah, so his brother talking crazy. And then I remember at the end he said some shit, some shit. He just started y'all. He was like, at the end he was like, y'all little niggas not crazy. The fuck, nigga. He was like, yo, stop touching my little brother for shit get hot. Mind you, I think he's like pump faking. He was just clutching on his hoodie. He had a hoodie on. Hunter was heavy right there. And then we were like, bro, fuck this nigga. Like, we gonna, we gonna violate this nigga later. Cause we don't know what he had for me, so we played it smart. So me and my friends just started like slowly walking away and shit. And then mind you, the nigga tried to chase us. Like, he tried to like, he was doing that, but we ain't run. We were like, nigga, we gonna walk away. Running from you? Never in a day in my life? Cap. She was just crazy, man. Like, I'm still like, it's still, it's still, I can't believe that was like the first time I ever something like that happened to me. I was that like 15, bro. I was that like 15, 16. Probably even younger. I don't even know. Like, I, I ain't even gonna tell my age, you know what I mean? Just know I'm a father of me. Now, this is when everything goes down. So now for me, after that happened, nigga, Robert is on my bad side now. He's on my bad side. Like, he's on his final stroll. For me so next day we go to school and shit and then uh we had another mutual friend everything i'm gonna lie it's just a mutual you know what i mean but we had mutual friends right and you know in, in new york if you, if you go to school in new york you know like at lunchtime niggas be cutting each other's ass and shit like that so our mutual friend was cutting for me they was cutting each other's ass him and robert and our mutual friend like he took it to the next level because he was like but see i want to get my son michael over here for me i just that Robert was like, yeah, but he was just like brushing it off. But then the mutual friend came to us, he was like, yeah, but pull up. At that time, Robert's on my bad side, so I'm thinking, yeah, but he say something stupid, I'm gonna just punch him. So, for me, when he said that, my son Michael at first was jacket, I'm like, yeah, but we out. We out, fuck it, nigga. We went to this table, we looked at him, and just sat down in front of him. My son Robert was looking everywhere and shit, you know what I'm saying, but we, we, I'm glad at that time, it was like, I felt like it was checkmate. It was like, yo, bro. Like, no honesty, bro. 
that shit was not that shit was dirt. <laughs> then you must have it was just a regular like I think obviously nigga gonna act crazy when you, there's like seven niggas behind one nigga you had beef with for me. It's common sense unless you really like feeling like you you dan old shit and shit. But word. So let me this is where all of it happened. So I think like a couple days after it's a couple days after. Boom. We just chill in the park. At that time, my son Michael already announced it. He was like, yeah, but we're not going to worry about this nigga no more. Like, he was like, that shit is just calm. It's corny, whatever, bro. We're just not going to jack him no more. I'm like, that's a fact. We're not going to jack him no more. And we told the group that we just don't jack them niggas no more. Fuck them niggas. Fuck them niggas. Like, that nigga's pussy, nigga. Sharp, nigga. Crazy, nigga. Word. For me, we just not going to jack them niggas no more. For me. Then. So we just chill in the park. We see a nigga pass by, we seen Robert pass by, we ain't say nothing, we like, fuck it, bro. But, we, we knew that he wanted to chill with us and shit like that. So then, <laughs> so then Robert leaves, I kid you not, but we was just, we ain't say nothing to that nigga, he's not sanctioned, he's not cool with us no more. So he leaves, and then the bitches that he was trying to fuck, the one that my man, stupid thought, let me stop, I'm that cool too. Now let me stop. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I have not touched this camera in a couple days. I forgot the whole story time. And I got a new guest. Give me show. She's fake chopped cheese, but we gonna pull through. Shut the the <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. What you just on me? What you just on me? Alright, cause it's the video. Oh, okay. So my fault. Let me. We was doing a story time about how I got shot at. You don't care? That's <laughs> <laughs> OD. I know exactly what was that. So boom. Yeah, so we was in this park, right? After the girls that, you know, the girls that what's his name? Robert tried to get on. Was still there and shit like that. They were still there. They were like, um, he's moving weird. I this that. And Robert left. Why the fuck you <laughs> So boom, right? So yeah, so Robert left. And next thing you know, we just chilling in the park, we just playing bull and shit. Me, Michael, GG and them for me. So I'ma throw up GG now. GG, you know. But worry, so we chillin' the pub, we just playing bull shit. Nigga, Robert come back with the fucking army. I swear, like, now nah, nah, I'm fake snitching. I'm, I'ma cut that anyway. But he came with mad people. It was like mad. Yo, what are you doing, baby? <laughs> me, but he came with mad people. I'm just like, damn. We playing bull shit, and they come up to my son Michael. Niggas like, yo, bro, you got a problem with my brother? Ah, this, that, third, fourth, fifth. That's my blood brother. Ah, this, that. Somebody goes like, yo, bro, like, we post that da 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 But they just kept on talking crazy, like, I remember, it was like, I don't remember, like, two of them. There was one, who, for me, I ain't gonna say nothing, but then it was the other one. He was just talking, but he was mad. <laughs> <laughs> continue, continue, continue. But there was the other one who was just mad cool and shit. He was doing all the politics, and he was mad cool, though. I fuck with him. Nah, I fuck with him heavy. Now I do. But, yeah, so he came. And then Robert had all this energy that came out of nowhere. I fuck with you now. Well, fuck you for that type of shit. You feel me? So Robert came with all this energy out there for fifth. And it was GG and them. It was all just chilling. So then, the nigga that came up to him said, You got a problem with my brother out there, the cool nigga. He was like, Now nah, what's up? Y'all gotta get it on. 30 seconds, I'll just stop. Me, Michael. Me, my son, Michael, get it on. Boom. Michael got on with Robert. And Michael, for me, on purpose, since Robert came with more people, someone just throw himself. Like, he was just throwing himself. Like, he was that beating the shit. Nah, I'm not, I'm not guessing. You're not beating. He was just punched, like, got, catching gut hits. Boom, boom, boom. Type shit. They're playing the circle and shit like that. But then, there was a time for me where Robert tried to get on, like, but no, my son Michael, like, he pretended like he was losing, so he just slipped. And then, boom, Robert tried to get up on him, tried to volley him. He was like, nah, fuck out of here. Like, we started, for me, like, everything started getting rowdy. Next thing you know, figure, listen, listen, there could have been no more rich DBG, your brother. Next thing you know, the nigga that, um, Robert brother, his means, what happened? backed out chop. Oh. Backed out that dang thing, like, he backed out chop, boom. Whoa. What the fuck? I'm looking at you live, hard drop to my ball sacks. I was mad scared, swear to God. I, I was right, mad right. scared, feel me? Right. Nah, my heart dead drops, nigga, what the fuck? <laughs> Talking about you dragged it, nigga. Niggas not super mean and shit. But 
backed out. Dang, boom. Hard drop to my bull sacks. I was like, what the fuck? Nah, I don't think he wants to comment now. I think he didn't want to kill somebody. He backed it out, do one in the air. Boom. I'm like, oh shit. And my ear was like, my eardrums was ringing. Mm. My eardrums was ringing. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm looking at everybody, I'm like, oh shit. And then all I see is this nigga like look at me. He look at me. As soon as he look at me, <laughs> that, was, that was enough for my time for me to be there. I ran to the where was it? I ran to like the, the benches and shit. I ran to the benches. And my, my heart is I'm like my heart is beating mad I'm just running. Do, 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 do. I'm just cooking it. I grab as much stuff. I, I grab my stuff first. I grab my stuff and as much as I can from my, my friends and shit. I'm running out the park. But then all I hear was Basically, basically his gun jam. His gun, ass. his gun jam. I'm pretty sure that nigga wanted to throw at us, like. But he, I'm gonna be like, he looked at me though, and then started like trying to chase me. So I'm just like, cooked it. Left out that part. Why, why are you making that face? Not right. Now, now you care, right? <laughs> yeah. Now you care, nigga chasing me with guns and shit. I'm just a good boy. For me, but yeah. Nigga, gun jam. I was cooking. But I'm pretty sure when, when I was running though, he tried to like throw at me, but the gun just jammed. So. Me and my twin, we be vibing. Damn, they said not we vibing. <laughs> but we're the bro, like, that shit was crazy though. Why so, are we laughing? This is a shootout. Nah, no funny Wait. shit. But then, after that, um, Robert Brother, it was a different guy for me. Not the one that came out talking crazy, you know, not him. Robert buddy came, he chopped at us, he was like, but he was like, bro, he was not gonna throw at y'all. But to the cops, we like, nah, we good, bro. We feel me, everything's situated. Like, this shit's situated, Ben Daddy. He was like, Robert just being weird. Nigga told the cops. And he apologized. Man. You said, niggas told the cops. I never talked to a cop a day in my life, nigga. Mm. But yeah, like, that is though. For me, so Robert Brothers being mad cool, but nigga that threw, nigga that threw one in the air, fuck you. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. I don't like you, bro. I'm gonna keep it a buck. Like, you was acting real crazy that day. I mean, oh, as of now, if I still know you now, now now you be cool for me. I should change. My back out chop on you. Why are you here, bro? Why are you here, bro? Are you jamming right now? <laughs> cross me by young boy. It's a time of crisis and you're jamming to cross me by young boy. The GOAT. Y'all look. <laughs> but where the build though, like, that situation that told me, like, there's certain shit you don't need to be, like, this, how you say, like, there's certain shit you don't need to be in, like, don't put yourself in situations that you, you was not needed to be in, like, just be calm, like, just live life type shit, like, you know what I'm trying to say, that all could have been situated if niggas just didn't do certain shit, like, there's just a lot of hidden animosity, like, if something bothers you with your means, tell a nigga straight up, like, put him to the side, I'm telling you, I'm not saying make a scene in front of everybody, put a nigga to the side, be like, yo, bro, you're bugging the fuck out on some shit though, like, you know. But all honesty, bro, situation not need. Look, I'm so glad Gun Jam. Look, I would have not been making this video right now. I'm looking dead at the camera, like there would have been no me. Fuck y'all niggas. Nah, so deep. That's so deep. That's so deep. But for me, that's the end of the story time. Let me know if y'all like it. Like, comment, subscribe. I love ya. For me. Please. Please like this video. Please. Let me stop. But that is the um like comment subscribe. And let me know if y'all want more of this story time shit. Let me know in the comments. I might drop little clips of the video of how it happened in person. But I need to cover mad people's faces. Buff my balls, me munchers. Bro. Big double G, my body. Fuck the block, won't stop at your lobby. We just ran up a big bag. If you broke, can't stay at this kickback. Yeah,